to brother. Um, so yeah, he kept pushing for what female it was, and there was a female in front of me, and I felt very uncomfortable and had to leave the room, and I didn't enjoy how he made me feel. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction, and why? For one point, I nominate Max, um, purely on strategy. I feel if there's an eviction at some point um, in, the, in the near future, he's my biggest, um, biggest threat. They may get, one of, get rid of one of the new people first. Um, so, him being... Do you think you can win, Big Brother? Um, I think that if I can survive one or two evictions, then I have a good shot at it. And I'd like to have the chance at surviving one, and I think it'll be between, between me and Max. You're out of time. That is all. Thank you, brother. Oh, he just scraped through, didn't he? Just doesn't help putting your foot on the here. chair before you start no. getting big brother offside. Now, you were just saying that you love Max. Yeah, he's a great bloke. Yeah, he's, he's fantastic. I admire those new blokes going in there. Yep. But for those of you who thought their new housemates would be nominated left, right and centre, they've only got one point each. And Claire, I understand, in the house today was getting rather suspicious that there was an unspoken alliance, and that means it's not really an alliance, between Camilla and Chris because they're starting to like each other in the house. And, of course, Camilla's enemy at the moment appears to be David. Yep. Thoughts? Do you think that could be accurate? Definitely. So you reckon that's possible? Because of our friendship, Camilla was definitely jealous of it. So. OK, and now that Chris is friends with Camilla, Camilla. maybe that could carry on. We'll have could to see do. how she nominates. Yep. It's good having you here as a spy. All right, now three <laughs> housemates have now popped an umbrella into the nomination cocktail. So let's have a sip of the tally board. There we can see David has four, Camilla has two. Then Chris on one, Jamie on one and Max on one. We're not quite halfway through our nominating. It is fascinating. It's like election night meets Jerry Springer. And coming up is our one and only Camilla. She says what she likes and she likes what she says. So who will she nominate this time? I don't have any problem with people getting through this game on merit. I have a problem with people who get a free ticket. He's argumentative, rude. Just because I say what I think about maybe more things than other people do, doesn't mean I'm a whinger. No one was hurt in that incident. It's all right. And I am here with the intriguing intruder himself, Darren. Now, Camilla is about to nominate. You've yes. been sitting here before every nomination saying who you think will be nominated. Camilla, who do you think she's going to go for? Uh, Dave and Max. And do you understand the logic behind saying that you're really good friends but still nominating? It is hard. Um, you know, I think I said a couple of times that you go in there, like Claire was one of my good friends in the house, but I had to nominate, so I did a strategical vote on So her. would you have honed in on the new housemates this week if you had to nominate tonight? Probably, because yeah. they are an easy target, just like I probably was in the first couple of weeks. Yeah. yeah. Did you have enough time, do you reckon, for the, those guys to get used to you, or do you wish you'd been in there right from the well, beginning? Well, last week Camilla got more votes than me, so... Yep. That says enough. It does say enough, and we'll move on from that, because <laughs> that's quite enough. All right, time now for Camilla to spill the nomination beans in the diary room of doom. Now, last week, she nominated Darren for being arrogant and rude. No offence. And for the very first time, she nominated her former bosom buddy, David, for being too caught up in the game. So I wonder if her new passion for Chris will affect her vote, or does she also have her eye on the finish line and will therefore nominate her arch competitors? It's getting I think it's really good. Big Brother, Camilla, to the diary room. Camilla, <laughs> shoot him down, love. Oh, she's got Literally. a chill song. Got, yeah, Ouch. I know, they did. That hurts. <clears throat> Camilla, who do you nominate for two points for eviction and why? 
Big Brother, I'd like to nominate Claire for two points. Um, Claire's one of my best friends in the house and I really do love her, but um, it's become very clear to me that she's here to win and um, that she's probably my greatest competition. Um, Claire hasn't been nominated for quite some time um, and was only nominated very early in the piece and coupling that with the fact that she um, has professed that she wants to win the money to save the animals, um, as she says, has made me feel that she's probably my greatest competition. Camilla, Big Brother warned you only moments ago, if you vote strategically, you need to explain why that housemate is a threat to you winning Big Brother. OK, you well... You haven't done that. Um, obviously, if I could choose myself over another housemate to win, I would do that and I feel that Claire is my greatest competition. She is an extremely strong female in the house and I guess in terms of social standing in the house, we're extremely similar. Um, and as I said, it's because of her um, passion and her altruistic reasons for wanting to win that I think that she really, really wants to be here towards the end and the fact that she's never been nominated or hasn't been nominated for a very long time. Who do you nominate for one point for eviction and why? I'd like to nominate David for one point. I have barely seen David for three weeks and I think this might have something to do with the fact that Darren was here. They spent a lot of time together. Um, when Darren left last night, it was pretty much the first time that, Darren, uh, that David sorry, has um, tried to spend time with me and I'm quite offended at the fact that he thinks that he can just sort of um, slip back into our friendship so easily after I feel that he's ignored me for the past um, few weeks. Camilla, you're almost out of time, but you haven't explained your nomination properly. Do so now. <clears throat> Obviously, I find it difficult to live with someone who, you know, feels that they can slip with, in and out of a friendship with me. Um, I'm upset with David for doing that, and I find it difficult to address the problem with him, but um, obviously still want to continue f being friends with him. But... Camilla, you're out of time. Mm -hmm. That is all. Were they accepted? They just did. I think he must have accepted. I was distracted by the heartbeat. Was that Camilla's or Big Brother's? It was Chris's. Oh, you think waiting it was Chris for waiting back. for her in the other yeah. room. Now, you were right because you said you'd nominate David. I was right, arch nemesis Claire. Claire. So, we still have new housemates with hardly any points at all. Let's have a look at the tally board. OK, at the very top, David with five, Camilla with two, Claire with two. I I think this is the first time she's ever got two points. Chris says, I'm so gobsmacked, can't speak. Chris won, Jamie won, <laughs> and Max won. Has everybody got a point? No, Crystal doesn't have one yet. Don't forget magical three-point twist so anything could happen. OK, three more housemates are yet to soak in the nomination emotional stain remover. And next up is birthday girl Crystal. She spent her time in the house being sugar and spice and all things nice, but has she left any clues as to who she might nominate tonight? I love Claire, but she doesn't understand me. She's never even had a bad day in this house. I hate making conversation with people that I can't talk to. He thinks that the Big Brother house is some kind of a boot camp. Um, I find he also belittles me at times, and um, this makes me feel uncomfortable and like I'm insuperior. and a beard as a necklace. Welcome back to Big Brother, where I'm with Darren and live nominations is proving to be like a box of chocolates. Yes, we're seeing that all the sweeties we thought were soft centres are giving us something to chew on. Still new housemates. I think they've only got is it one each. I'm one just each. looking at another score, but yeah, it's about one each. Crystal's about to go up. Now, I yep. know it annoyed Dave in the house that Crystal would talk about wanting to be an actress and want her career. Did it bug you? 
She was always going on about neighbours. and She wanted to be on neighbours. Yeah, been looking in the mirror and fixing her eyes all the time and her hair. So. But you don't think she could work in television? I don't what? think she could. Because you think she'd just stare at a reflection in the camera? Yes. <laughs> really? <laughs> you know, I think she 